my biggest order I have ever received. It's kind of sad at the same time. We have a bit of a problem, so I've kind of failed in this video. Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to the Fauna Rose YouTube channel. If you are new here, my name is Megan and I'm the owner of Fauna Rose and I make and sell scrunchies, macrame, home decor, glassware and a huge bunch of goodies like that. And in today's video, it's just going to be a Sunday reset. I'm getting ready for the week ahead because I've got a really busy week, well, a really busy year. <laughs> ahead of me so I'm just prepping for that so we are getting ready for the week ahead so you're going to join me today on the Sunday reset however it is 10 to 3 currently I've been pottering about I've done quite a lot of things today kind of spring cleaning lots of washing just getting on top of weekly boring tasks I've been doing the odd little bit here and there fauna rose related but I've got a few thanks that I want to say before I do get into this video so firstly we have to thank Angela, Benice, Sarah, Stacey and Rhea because you guys have put in some really cool orders this weekend which I am incredibly incredibly grateful and included in that order is my biggest order I have ever received so Sarah <laughs> what <laughs> I remember getting the notification through just thinking is that a typo <laughs> 40 items 40 items Sarah has ordered from my shop. I honestly cannot believe it. You guys this weekend have absolutely blown my mind. Every single order means the world to me, whether it be one item or 40 items. <laughs> Honestly, I cannot believe it. So you guys, thank you so much. So once I've done a bit of tidying, I am going to be packaging them up ready for tomorrow. Benice and Stacey, you guys have landed on a freebie heart, so you'll be getting a freebie in your order. And Rhea will also be getting a freebie in her order because Rhea is one of my incredible Fauna Rose family members. So let's do another thank you because I haven't even launched my family memberships yet. As in like you can join them already but there's no content available until the 1st of March when they officially launch and Rhea has joined already so Rhea thank you so much for joining the memberships and putting an order in this weekend. I am so grateful. So I have already mentioned some of the members in the last video I believe. I just want to say a massive thank you to Chelsea, Katie, Diane, Jane, Evie and Rhea for joining the Fauna Rose family memberships. If you don't know what I'm talking about it's basically like Patreon but it's on a different platform it's just on my buy me a coffee page where people can subscribe and they can get a bunch of extra content and yeah like I said I've not even launched it properly yet and I already have those incredible six family members so guys thank you so much I can't even believe it I was very surprised I even got one let alone six of you so guys thank you so much there is the podcast episode and the bonus mini video for the fauna tier 
all ready to go it's all scheduled which is really exciting so again thank you guys so much if you want to join all the information is down below it's on my buy me a coffee page like i said and there is three tiers we've got the tip tier the flora tier and the fauna tier so if you're interested in extra content check that out but i am going to stop rambling and we are going to get into giving this office a little bit of a tidy get these orders parceled up and then see what else we can get done in preparation for the week ahead <laughs> all your little name cards made up so let's grab everybody's orders first angela has gone for the jess mini the coffee and anxiety motel keychain and the belinda mini so let's grab those jess mini belinda mini fueled by ice coffee and anxiety keychain this one's gone down really popular i really like this one so i'm glad you guys do too so next we have benice benice has gone for the alex mini and then two of the macrame candy cane decorations i said this in a past video that i struggled to sell these before christmas and now we're in the new year i have put them on sale but not buy that much and they're all nearly sold out so we've got the checkerboard alex scrunchy and then each one of those macrame candy cane decorations and benice did land on a freebie so let's grab her a freebie i'm gonna pop in this black flora scrunchy as a freebie so angela and benice thank you guys so much i'm gonna parcel your orders up first <laughs> next let's get Sarah's order I'm not ready for this there's so many items I cannot believe it before I get into the scrunchies let's grab the extras so Sarah has gone for not just one but two of the scrunchie stands and when I show you how many scrunchies Sarah has managed to pick up you'll understand why she may need both <laughs> so two of those there these cellar bags are compostable recyclable and biodegradable because i try and only use 100 percent eco-friendly or recycled packaging so in case you're wondering they can't be recycled sarah has then gone for the last alex tote bag so sarah thank you so much right are we ready for the scrunchies here they all are we've got the alex miss daisy jess danny jennifer olive brooke amy daphne alicia Stella, lauren amber sapphire audrey <gasps> Pumpkin Mia, Zoe, Emma, Aquabelle, Holly, Faith, Bailey, Emerald, Cleo, Donna, and Sylvia. That's pretty much every scrunchie I stock. I'm going to lay them out in colour order, make sure I definitely have them all and the order is 100% there. Pan you guys down and show you how amazing this order is. Oh my word. Look at all of the scrunchies. There's like 28 or something there. Oh my word. <laughs> Sarah, thank you so much. How gorgeous do they all look together? I've also just realised I've definitely miscalculated that there isn't quite 40 items and I think there's 30 something, but regardless. <sighs> Sarah, Sarah, thank you. So I know you didn't land on a freebie, but I'm gonna at least pop a little scrunchie in as a thank you because...
would. assume that you could tell how much I was struggling with this parcel then because I'm just not prepared for really big orders. Well I am but I'm not. When they're full of items of different sizes and shapes that's where I'm like I don't know what to put it in because as you would have seen the scrunchie stands fit perfectly in those pip boxes and they do need protecting and make sure that they don't bend but I have managed to get them all in here. So finally let's get Stacey and Rhea's orders. I'm so excited. You guys are too good to me. Well, Stacey has gone for, oh we've got a can cup, amazing. The Celestial Glass can cup, then a motel keychain, the same as the other one, the white one that says coffee and anxiety on it and a Clara scrunchie as well so that's exciting. Let's grab those. So this is the Clara scrunchie that Stacey's gone for as well as the celestial glass can cup this is the white design it does have a little blue in so it just to help you see the design a bit better but it is clear glass obviously won't forget the straw and then the motel keychain again and then Rhea has gone for the holly xl which is the bright barbie pink xl scrunchie and the serena mini which is the lovely marble silver white and black one and then Rhea has gone for the last mystery box which is so exciting that is the last ever one it's kind of sad at the same time but Rhea thank you so much it's been sat there waiting for a home and I'm so glad it's going to you so I hope you like the surprise items that are in there and then because like I said Rhea very kindly joined one of my tiers I'm going to throw in freebie bookmark and some floral vinyl decals so you can pop them on mirrors and stuff like that. So let's get these last two ones parceled up. Have a bit of a problem i'm just sorting out shipping labels and i'm doing all the customs forms and everything for sarah's order and as i'm scrolling down to count the quantity of each items for the customs form i got to the bottom of where i could view on my phone and there was an extra one two three four five six seven eight nine items on it so there is potentially over 40 items on this order and I obviously haven't packaged them. I don't know what to do. I don't think I've got a box slash bag big enough for the order. Let me just grab them. This is why you double check your orders. I don't know why it wasn't showing me the whole order on my phone. Well, it was coming up as the whole order, but obviously not. So we've missed off the Joyce Mini, the Allison Mini, the Primrose and the Lilo Mini, the Veronica Mini, the Belinda Mini, the Serena Mini, the Sandy Mini and the Ruby Mini. So I'm pretty sure, oh, I'm quite gutted that I didn't have a photo of all of them before, but I'm pretty sure that's every one of my satins. <laughs> oh, honestly, Sarah, thank you so much. We need to figure out 
what I'm gonna do, but let me get these parceled up. <sighs> Round two, let's package it up again. <laughs> so this is my plan. Sarah, <laughs> I'm so sorry. I have this box. Oh, just hit myself in the face with it. It does have sellotape on it, which I know isn't eco-friendly, but it's already on the box, so I'm not just gonna rip it off and waste it. But the scrunchie stand obviously won't fit in this, so my plan is to do another Frankenstein parcel of that one on the bottom, that one on the top. And I'm gonna see if I can then wrap it in an eco-friendly poly mailer. I'm so sorry, Sarah. Thank God I looked. That one. In there. The last one in there. And your freebie. Fits perfectly in there. I do need to have a look into some bigger boxes, but they're just, they're very expensive. Sarah, I'm so sorry it looks like this, but hopefully it'll get to you safely. I'm so sorry. Especially because it's your first order and this is what you're gonna get presented with. This is why I can't have nice things. Hi, bubbles. The shirt's covered in claw marks because of you. I don't know why I thought it was a great idea to sit and make up loads of boxes. These arrived recently. I think I did film some of this earlier, but I started counting some of the leaflets for the Creative Makers Market, and I put a bunch in an envelope with a little note saying, if anyone wants to give these out, so when I go to events, I can give them out to customers and things like that just to help advertise our event. So I just thought it'd be easier to get a bunch pre-parceled up. Just so when the time comes and we chose our stall holders, I can just pop their address on and a stamp and get them sent out straight away. I've just been doing little bits really. I think I'm just procrastinating. I don't want to tidy the office. I'm tired. So I've kind of failed in this video. It's quarter past seven already. But what I think I'm gonna do in preparation for tomorrow is probably go make myself a cup of coffee and keep you see yeah you can see a little stack of fabric here i am gonna pre-cut this fabric and possibly this one then tomorrow i can get them made up
a lot of <laughs> sorry that's koshka that is quite a lot of fabric strips i did leave a little bit this fabric for myself in case i wanted to do like a personal project in the future but there's a lot there so i obviously need to mix up the fabrics a little bit otherwise if someone bought like four mystery scrunchies they might end up with four of the same one but at least some of the sorry koshka is now on my knee so at least i've got some fabric strips ready for mystery scrunchies that i can make throughout the week i did make myself a coffee and when i went down typical me style as the kettle was boiling i then got distracted and decided it was great to reorganize tidy and clean the entire kitchen then as i was doing that i noticed there was a bit of mud and dirt on the floor because i'd done the washing earlier outside and i traipsed a bit of mud back in so i started brushing up the floor and then i saw my cup of coffee and was like oh yeah that's why i came down had a sip of my coffee and and then remembered oh I came down because I was actually in the process of sorting my office so I need to go and carry on doing that abandoning the brush I'm pretty sure the brushes lay down in the kitchen with the pile of dirt and mud I then came back and carried on so I now need to go down and carry on doing that I've still got a few more like household chores a few other things that I need to sort that's just really boring I'm not gonna go into but I'm gonna leave this video here sorry that this was a bit of a random one this week I thought it would be a good way to get me motivated but instead it's just tired me out <laughs> But I have definitely achieved quite a lot today. I've done a lot of household stuff and I have somewhat prepped myself for a rose related for the future. I've got some orders packed. Yeah, quite a lot of things done, but it is now very late. But if you did enjoy this video, if you could give it a massive thumbs up, leave me a comment down below and subscribe if you aren't. All the social media for Fauna Rose is linked down below, including the website if you wanted to check it out. So feel free to head on over there and check that out. <laughs> also, if you wanted to join my memberships, like I've mentioned a couple times in this video, it's all linked down below. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye bye.